Goa is one of the few places where old hippies continue to live. In markets like the Saturday Night Bazaar in Arpora or Flea Market in Anjuna is where you might find them still. We are at Anjuna Flea Market where the foreigners and the localites and uh, also people from all over India are selling uh, clothes, artifacts, antiques, uh, spices, jewellery, you name it, most of the stuff at very uh, cheap, bargainable price. Did you hear about the hippies? Well, this is the spot where everything started in Goa, in Anjuna. Why flea market? Flea, fly, flu, flu. flu. <laughs> so the hippies used to come here during the high season and during the low season, during the monsoons, they used to go home. So behind us, we have the flea market where Namita and I are going shopping. Let's go. The first hippies arrived to Goa at the end of the 60s and Anjuna, Vagator, Baga, Arpura became their home. Here they felt they could run away from the conservative morals of old Europe. At first, they used to just play music, smoke pot or even swim naked in the sea under the bright moonlight. Then, in the 80s came the famous full moon parties with electronic music, opium and heroin. Goa now becomes pretty famous. the villages of the coastal belt who until now were kind of indifferent started protesting and the authorities took measures to forbid strong music outdoors and any kind of noise after 10 o'clock in the night. The full moon parties are now an underground affair. Even though these measurements were taken, the coastal belt continued to develop, adapting to the new coming tourists. One way to experience this is to visit the Wednesday market in Anjuna, the flea market, or the Saturday night bazaar in Arpora. With luck, you might find the same hippies remembering those nostalgic days of the 60s while the newcomers enjoy the spices, jewelry, handicrafts, food and many other things. But do remember that Goa is not only the coastal belt. To find out more, subscribe to our channel and don't forget to click the bell button to be always updated. See you next time!